Well, god damn, ladies and gentlemen, we have another controversy in gaming, and quite frankly, this is next level. This is truly insane. A lot of people are mad, and for right reasons, understandably so. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I do want to give you a warning, because this is going to be really serious. This is indeed about gaming. I cannot understand that we are really talking about stuff like that in gaming, specifically Activision and Call of Duty. Now, I also want to say this, okay, if you got kids around, just send them to play okay like this is not the video for them if you got young siblings in my honest opinion you should educate yourself on this and once you have because even i did i just found out about this one that it is insane it is truly insane that this is this is real and then once you have you can tell, talk to your young siblings if you feel comfortable because if I was in your shoes, I probably wouldn't. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I highly recommend that you share this video after you have seen it, because this is truly important. We need answers uh, to this one, and I do believe that in the coming days, it might get deleted. And do not expect, like, the Disney Call of Duty channels to cover this one. They will very likely not cover this. And for this video, just ignore this, okay? I, 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 some of you might be commenting, but that's not important. It Pots made a video on this. Now, what we're talking about is the the call of duty sake dong bundle there is the other side a lot of you actually added me a lot of you actually reached out to me and you were like okay skizzle you gotta cover this and i waited a day and there's an opposite side that is kind of defending activision which i really want to talk about because the the severity of this situation is insane in quotes we're talking about edp i i, I think you understand where we're going but if you still don't we're talking about pd Whole po department, but again, that's not what we're talking about. If you're still not getting what we're talking about, you will in just a little bit, and viewers' discretion is advised because this is really, really insane. Now, it thoughts made a video on this. Shout out to the ghost of it, it thoughts, uh, and shout out to it's Hapa, a channel with 8.69 thousand subscribers, did incredible work. And uh, this is, I believe, the first guy to ever notice, or probably somebody else noticed, but this is probably the first guy to make a video. Now, credit to anyone who made a video, but I'm just not aware who else made. Now, I want to play you this clip again this is about this camel that activision put in and just watch this video for a second okay? rails that i've ever seen explain exactly what the map community is and exactly what it is that they're trying to normalize so apparently i've been living under a rock for the past few years because there's a thing called a <coughs> pride flag. Now this flag doesn't come as a surprise to me at all because I halfway expected <coughs> to be legalized many years ago because Democrats are too so low to be inclusive to everybody. So this right here is the <coughs> flag. The technical term of this flag is MAP, which stands for Minor Attracted Persons. Now the fact that this flag even- Man, like, I, I feel like that this video is gonna hit really hard to especially the parents, especially to the fathers and to the mothers and um, I, I don't know, man. It's not my place, but I feel like that <sighs> this is truly disgusting. And any person with a soul quickly gonna realize how evil this is. If you're a dad, if you're a father, it's your place. But I feel like that once you have educated yourself, it's we should not be teaching stuff like that to the kids. I mean, kids are kids. Let them play, man. Let them enjoy their, their time. And once they're older, then you can talk about these serious topics. But I feel like that in this day and age, it's still, it's your right, okay? Uh, I'm not gonna push anything on you, but this is like a recommendation. Just take it from, um, as a friend, okay? A recommendation from a friend. After you have seen this video, after you have educated yourself, I guess it's important that you talk to your kids about this because realistically, man, I, I genuinely, and, and it's disgusting that I'm even saying this but they are trying to push this they're trying to normalize this in a five years 10 years 20 years 50 years i don't know how long but this is gonna get normalized too this is this is insane man so if you got young siblings around and you feel comfortable because i truly wouldn't be if i was in your shoes but if you feel comfortable uh talk to your kids talk to your siblings about this one uh, it is important it is important exists is disgusting in itself but once i actually look at this flag and look at the colors it disgusts me even more. So here's a breakdown of what the colors mean on the flag. The top two stripes are blue to represent attraction to young boys. The bottom two stripes are pink to represent attraction to young girls. The inner yellow stripes are to represent childhood and general attraction to minors regardless of their gender. And the middle stripe is white to represent innocence and unwillingness to offend. How disgusting. That coupled with the fact- Man, like this, and there is more though. And this is a massive, this is very severe, okay? This is like, 
putting Activision in a very bad light. And I want to say this, uh, for years I'm not enjoying Call of Duty, I, I don't like the practices that they are doing, but again, man, it would be unjust if, if I do not, and it would be unjust if anyone does not cover the other side, because this is really severe. What if this is a mistake? I highly doubt that. It's very hard for me to believe that this was a mistake, but le let's, uh, let's try to be objective, okay? What if this is a mistake? What if an employee really did that, and that's one employee, a PD employee, that really wanted to push this out and i genuinely feel like that they're gonna remove this but if they don't i don't know man this is truly disgusting they're selling this in the shop by the name of Seik dong and you see this camo pattern he will uh, in fact show that i believe in a bit but the opposite side allegedly activision is doing that i will say allegedly uh because uh, apparently the situation here is that this is linked with Seik Tong. Now this is my first time f finding this one out. So if you're Korean, if you're Chinese, uh, no disrespect. Uh, I do not have any knowledge on this whatsoever. But from what I gather, it's a tradition. It's a tradition and it's a bunch of colors, right? It's nothing harmful. It's the colors. Uh, and if you have more knowledge, definitely let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear your thoughts and your opinions. And apparently Activision made this for that specific reason but however it is quite different i'm gonna put my face cam here it is uh this is a camel and this is that nomad flag which i really was not aware we should not be talking about this but it is important because this is really gonna get normalized eventually right they're trying to push this absolutely disgusting but when you look at this camel and this flag it is very much similar man it is very much similar. Maybe I'm missing something. You see the pink, pink here? White is kind of like okay in the middle, but yellow is there. Uh, there's blue there, there's dark blue there, and then there's like brown, brown, that's just the the, the, the weapon, whatever, right? But the, 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 the pink, white, yellow, blue, dark blue, that's like the main thing here. And it correlates with the map very well. Aside from this white color, right? The white color is kind of like in the middle. It should have been like, where the yellow color is in a in a way or above above yeah above above yellow so it's a little bit different and i will give them the benefit of the doubt but it's like very hard for me to believe this i want to play this clip again the, the blueprint that they just released is named Seikdon, which is explained by the korean american center.org that the Seikdon, a style of clothing meaning literally colorful stripes but during the Joseon dynasty, its application became more extensive, including upper garments for first birthdays, children's ceremonial attire, children's outer coats, and children's headgear. And if we reference our TikToker friend's explanation of the colors and arrangement and their meaning, we can clearly see that the map flag is 100% being yeah. represented right there on the guns magazine. Yep. The blue stripe at the top to represent maps that are attracted to young boys. The pink stripe at the bottom to represent maps that are attracted to young- You, you guys think it's a mistake? You guys think it's a mistake or you guys think they're genuinely pushing this? Because yeah, I'm covering the other side, but it's like, I don't know, man. And this controversy is really going crazy over on Twitter. A lot of people are believing that Activision really did do that. A lot of people are also saying that Activision did not. Jigot actually responded by saying that just searching up the blueprint name would probably be useful since Google exists. And it is hella suspect. The color are kind of same, but not at the same time, but it's kind of same. Some people saying Americans being American. People also saying keep defending and this is some serious stuff that I cannot say on YouTube. People also saying I don't understand why they didn't just make it the same colors from top to bottom yeah guys another day another controversy i feel like that they're gonna definitely gonna talk about this because this is i feel like that a lot more youtubers will be covering this very soon but really do not expect any like call of duty disney channel to cover this do not expect like any youtuber that gets blown out to cover this guys like and, and no disrespect to them i mean like they probably want to chase their dreams they probably want to feed their family they want to be playing the the brand new call of duty right so they're not gonna be covering this uh, but I, I would suggest like you send this to Yongya yeah, because I feel like that he's gonna cover this. Um, I hope so he does. I feel like he's gonna, but maybe he won't. And if he doesn't, that's perfectly fine. That's his right. I don't know, man. Doesn't feel right, man. Um, I guess I'll see you in the next video, guys.